Come on, you red. We are palace. You ready for me? Don't enough. Blow hot right now. You be done. Bring it on, boys. This isn't just football. This is everything. Seems unlikely they're going to sign a striker today, but they are in this title race. Third, five points off the top. Are you disappointed that they haven't managed to strengthen, particularly up top? It's hard. It's the hardest position in the, in the world to try and get a centre forward. I mean, the, the one that was around was probably Ivan Tony, but, you know, if that wasn't done on the 1st of January, it was probably never, ever going to be done, you know, when the window opened again. So, for me, they'll, they'll go with what they did. It covers over the cracks when they go and beat Palace 5. You watch them against Forest the other night, they absolutely dominated, and you're thinking, you, you know, missing chance after chance. It comes down to this weekend. You know, they were wasteful in the FA Cup. If they, if they lose to Liverpool, they're out of the title race. So, for me, it all comes down to this weekend. It's a cup final. But it's basically the same old mm. story with us. Isn't they, they haven't had a front man for quite some time. Yeah. How desperately do they need one? Yeah, I, I watched the, the Forest game on, on, on Tuesday. And, as Mayor said, a lot of the ball, not too much in the way of threatening, I thought, from Forest's point of view, whether that's to do with the team sitting very, very deep to make sure that there's no gaps. I don't know. But you look at... I, was just, I just asked Mayor about dropping Emil Smith Rowe in and just kind of is that has he been chucked in to kind of say we believe in you to be able to be that type of player that can unlock defences or is it to say well you're here now so we're not really going to let you go anywhere else which is a bit of a, of a dynamic for, for that player to particularly contend with they have got so much attacking threats and some days New Year's Eve for example against Fulham it looks completely blunt there's no uh, clinical nature or edge to it but in the Forest game, they managed to get over the, over the line. And maybe if you are an Arsenal fan with eyes very much firmly on the top of the league, not beating teams in, those, in that particular manner well and putting three, four, five past them akin to the um, Crystal Palace game doesn't fill you with much um, optimism going forward. 